Okay, so I pushed my limits again and I used metallic fabric and I blew it. Now, I always like to show my mistakes to help prevent y'all from doing what I just did. And I know better. I mean, I've made this mistake before, but pushed it and of course, you know, what is the definition of insanity? Repeating the same mistake and expecting different results. Um, and of course I didn't get different results. I pulled up some of the DTF when I went over and ironed it. This is on that metallic fabric, same stuff I had the issue with the other day. But hey, it was a Christmas design. I just had to use this fabric again. So let me show you what I'm going to do to fix this. Now I've got my black Fabrico marker and I'm gonna come in here and I'm going to color, since it's just a small little section and try to mimic the line that was there. Okay, that doesn't look too bad. But you can still see it's kind of bumpy now. It's not perfect like the rest of these are. Um, I ended up having to do it here too. You can see where I fixed it right there. Uh, what can I say? I just am a glutton for punishment. Um, so just learn not to be a glutton for punishment like me. Hope this helps you. Stay tuned though, I will end up coloring this. Um, this was the full extent of the DTF. So it's about mm, 30 inches uh, by 22 inches. And I just really wanted to show you what a vector file, by the way, that's what this is from Shutterstock, what it looks like as a DTF. I'm just sorry that once again, I tried to push my luck, but again, live and learn. Stay tuned for more.